No matter how much I've been trying to hide it, how many of you have noticed when I come into Mission Planner, go over to grab the full perimeters list, that there's always this item in the top that's checked as a favorite. <laughs> I accidentally did that about six months ago. And frequently when I'm editing videos, I'll notice that I forgot to try to cover that up. <laughs> and when I'm making the videos frequently, and you guys probably see me, sometimes uh, I just too lazy to edit it out completely in the final video. I'll come up here and uncheck that real quick. I, I haven't said anything about it. Wasn't trying to pull the wool over your eyes or anything. That's uh, just something I got in there accidentally about six months ago. I went out on the internet searching for a fix. I saw lots of people complaining about it. I don't know if I heard Painless 360 say it or if it was something he wrote, but I know f and I can go back and find some of his or do mission planner videos right now that <laughs> he's got a favorite checked in the top of his too. He can't get rid of. And he did not get an answer to his uh, request for help. If anybody knew how to fix that, uh, I'm just a little old hobbyist, got no rights to be uh, trying to school him or help him, uh, but I am a little tempted to go. Did you ever you know, somehow contact him and say, did you ever get that fixed? And if you didn't, you can try my way. So the first thing I did when it was happening to me is I came into the full perimeters list for the uh, uh, platforms that I was flying and well, just grab one here at random. Uh, I'll just open it in Notepad. And I looked at the top of this to see if something was there in italic or some kind of comments or something that said uh, Serial 6 Options is a favorite of this platform. Went to the bottom looking for that. No, just as I suspected, this is literally just... Uh, Whatever perimeter you can change, comma, and the value you set it to. It's nothing more than that. One line for each perimeter in Hardu Copter, Rover, Tracker, whatever you're using. If you come down to the Serial 6 option, uh, Oops, uh, need to use a non-copter uh, parameter list. <laughs> if you come down to the serial six option, right here, here it is. It's not an italic, it's not bolded, it doesn't have a semicolon after the end of it and say favorite out to the right of it nothing nothing identifying it so i couldn't find anything in the perimeter file that was doing that then i noticed the other day even just disconnecting from the uh, platform it pops back up here disconnect boom boom there it is again wow Reconnect to the platform. Take it away again. It's gone. Disconnect. Wow, it's back. What the hey? Remove it. Connect to the platform. And it's back. What the hey? Come on now. So what that really proves is that it's in the mission planner. 
area, not the platform. So if we come out of here, I uh, might as well just stay in the same file browser. You go to your main hard drive, your user subdirectory. This is Windows 7, probably all the way back in Windows 3.1. Uh, whatever user you're logged on as, documents, you're going to find a mission planner subdirectory. This is the default area for your logs. Here's all your logs. Uh, when you download logs and stuff, they go in there. That's their default area. And if you come right in here and find this file that says config.xml and you edit it, I'm going to stop right here and I'm going to tell you. This is not an Ardu pilot, mission planner, or any other organization's fix for this problem. This is mine, mine alone. I am not telling you to do it. I'm saying you can try it if you're careful. Because the first thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to copy that file. Oops. Ah, just wash my hands, can't do a thing with it, with them. There we go, finally, copy. I'm just going to paste it back right here. So this is the contents of the original file. And then I'm going to edit config.xml. Now I'm going to edit it with WordPad. This is not a lesson on editing files. This is not a lesson on how much trouble you can get into editing files. You pull it up in a word processing program and write it out. You're probably going to write it out in something other than just straight text. So, I mean, there's so many ways to get in trouble here. You have to be confident with editing this file without harming it. That's why we make a copy first so that if you destroy this file, you can just rename this one never work with the original file. Sometimes uh, in the old days, they would come in and just rename it and put a .old on the end of it or something like that, and then make a copy of that and work with it. So all sorts of ways. What I'm saying to you is you mess it up. I didn't do it, but this is what I did. I edited it, came in here and looked for Serial six. And there it is. And I just went home key, shift key, end key, delete key. Slide, a favorite params, opening header, whatever you call it. It's kind of like an HTML file. Serial six options and a closing slash favorite params. I took it out, exited, told WordPad to save it. It is a text file. Now I come back into Mission Planner, connect to my platform. The new version of Mission Planner really reads in parameters quickly. Go over to the full parameters area. Man, look at that. Serial six options is no longer up there. It starts out alphabetically a acro locking uh, as it should. <laughs> Been working on this for six months. You go down to serial six options here. Uh, serial seven. Serial six options right here. This is no longer there's a favorite out here, bubbling it to the top. When you disconnect from the platform, see it reads back in the perimeter list at that time. That's why this comes back up the way it does. But because that favorite line in the config XML file is no longer there. It doesn't start out with serial options as a favorite. Oh man, the humidity dehumidifier is kicking up behind me. 
Sorry about that. We'll just finish this up. See, it's no longer there. Click, disconnect, reconnect. It's no longer there. <laughs> I've been chasing that for six months. Can't remember if I made a video on that or not in the past. Don't know if Painless 360 knows there's a fix for it. Hopefully somebody got to him privately or whatever. Told him there's a fix for it. Oh, well, now then again, let me well, look out here. This is my personal solution for it you can use if you like. It's your little red wagon if things blow up. Uh, that. I, I can't go into how to edit a file and keep from really messing up a file badly uh, in this video. But that's the way I fix the how do you remove a favorites from the full perimeter list in Mission Planner. I have not yet found an answer on the Internet, so this will be my answer for the Internet. Thank you.